Hey guys, Zach here. So today we are going to review the M18 Brushless Sawzall. If you come from the corded universe, uh, this tool is gonna feel super familiar to you. Literally, this thing is a hoss. It feels just like my corded one. Um, and it seems to work just the same as my corded one. So it's kind of nice for that space, right? I don't have the capability of an extension cord, whatever. Um, you gotta carry it up on a ladder, don't wanna go tripping yourself. This is a really good option, just like everything else in the M18 universe. Any of the batteries ranging from however many amp hours to 12 crazy amp hours though that might be a little bit much on this thing. Um, when you pick it up, there is definitely some weight to this tool, which is good, right? You're using an itty bitty blade or a long blade, whatever. Uh, cutting something, you do want that weight behind it to kind of let the tool do the job. So um, again, if, if you are familiar with that universe in any way, shape or form, this is a well worthwhile either backup or main tool, depending on what you're doing. Um, you got a nice little hanger here, whether you're on a ladder, tool belt, whatever, um, you have that option. Uh, as far as the changes go, um, awkward thumb screw right here for blade change outs, whatever blades you're going to use, um, battery pops right in like any other. And again, brushless, kind of nice to be stepping into the brushless realm with the tools. Ah, always my gripe on M18 uh, tools is the, the battery locking system. It's good and it's bad. If you're looking for a Sawzall uh, to use in a pinch or even depending on your space as a main tool, M18 brushless sawzall. Pretty solid tool, definitely worth the buy. Uh, this does come in some kits, as well as those specials that go on every now and then as a get a free bear tool. Um, so if you're in the, the market for a decent handheld battery operated sawzall, I'd say the M18 brushless is definitely worth the buy. <laughs> 